A study by the Nelson Mandela Metropolitan University in Port Elizabeth estimates that the ocean economy will contribute 54 billion rand to South Africa's GDP, creating nearly 316,000 jobs when fully operational. To further explore these, a total of 24 aquaculture projects have been opened across the country. A potentially multi-billion rand industry, fairly new and largely untapped in South Africa. But the tide is turning and the country is exploring every possible benefit it can draw from it. Funded to the tune of 10.5 million rand, it strikes a balance between preservation and consumption of the ocean delicacies that we love to feast on. I think we've been over-exploiting our, our, our uh, coastline, our natural resources. And, um, uh, you know, we cannot can continue um, doing that. So it makes sense to, um, to try and farm them, um, which is what we're doing. With success, but... Um, it's early days still. The Hambeck project employs 21 people from the community. At nearly one kilogram, these are almost ready to hit the market. And the people who raise them have no fears of the quality of their produce. When I see the, the oyster and the fish to the other, other villages and to the other restaurants, um, I'm, I was so happy and I'm excited that when I see those, those oysters and the fish, oh, they, this is my fish and this is my oysters, and I know my fish and my oysters, they taste good. I'm feeling great to work in here because I learned so many things here. Um, I started here knowing nothing, but now I know something about the fish, about the oyster. So I'm supporting my family, even my brother is at school now because of I'm um, working here. Protection of this valuable resource is also high on the agenda. These EPWP workers ensure that the coastline is clean and protected for those who derive economic benefit from it. It is important for us in order we see people that they're coming from different places in order to make friends, friendship with us also as well as we are proud of them that they're coming in our place of humble. Authorities say they try to keep conditions as close to their natural habitat as possible. With these machines, the water in these tanks is pumped directly from the ocean. Unatipingwase, ABC News.